Sailing is a beautiful activity. In this uh, snapshot, the sun is rising at 6.25 a.m. in the morning. Uh, it is my shift in the, in the sailboat. So uh, while we are crossing the Adriatic Sea, we are going to have breakfast here and approximately we are going to arrive to Bari in Italy in another six hours. An amazing, magic moment to live in the Adriatic. Hello, uh, my name is Na Furman. I am the skipper and owner of Marguerite, uh, my Janu 36i sailboat. She was built in France in the year 2010. And uh, my sailing adventure started in 2021. I purchased the boat in uh, Croatia, and then I sailed uh, from Croatia to Italy, southern coast of Italy. Then I proceeded to Sicily via the Messina Strait between Italy and uh, Sicily, and uh, sailed the northern part of Sicily, the coast that um, uh, got me to Palermo. Uh, in Sicily. Then I sailed to Sardinia Island and across the Tyrrhenian Sea, then to Minorca uh, through the Balearic Sea and also Majorca, the island of Ibiza, and finally Spain. Marguerite, uh, she is at anchor uh, today in January 2022 in Torrevieja Marina in the southern Spain, Costa Blanca. Uh, this is my crew um, members, Patrick at the helm, uh, David uh, sitting in the foreground, and Finn uh, in the background. Here uh, you can see the uh, GPS uh, plotter, uh, you can see in the map the approaching of the coast of Italy, port of Bari, and uh, we are just about maybe 10 nautical miles from the, from the port. Uh, here is my uh, good friend Patrick and his son uh, Finn at the helm. And uh, we are all very, very excited uh, to get into uh, Italy, Bari, after um, 26 hours of sailing. And we are just uh, very, very excited about it. So uh, I'll show you a little bit about uh, the entrance to the port in, a in the next uh, shots. Uh, here is my good friend, David. At the bow of the boat, we have um, uh, we are approaching the port of Bari in Italy, uh, and I recommend strongly uh, to enter port during the daytime, as many fast ferry boats get into and out of the port. You can see one approaching here uh, as we are actually uh, getting into the marina. Uh, it can be dangerous at night due to the to the heavy traffic and the fast movement of these uh, ferry boats. Uh, you can see here uh, very clearly uh, a ferry boat approaching us very quickly, and um, we are kind of going to uh, turn to the to the starboard side to avoid it. Uh, this is the yacht harbor in Barry. There were just a few yachts. And this is the fortress of San Clement in Barry.
Oh, this is the beautiful town of Monopoly and we are right by the harbor and uh, we are just about to go into this uh, old um, archaeological site here in, um, in Monopolis and uh, we're going to leave the boat on the, um, on the harbor it's kind of a wall that uh, is free for 24 hours and uh, you are allowed to um, go to the town and uh, look around but it's very very convenient um, we have set it up so the boat is moored here yep. by this side and uh, we are going to go around perhaps to the city city walls uh, there are this beautiful uh, area here okay. so, that's it. this is the towns of monopoly and we just arrived here it's just a beautiful beautiful Italian place and they are celebrating the, the day of the uh, imagery of the sea of uh, what does it mean to be on the sea so they have pictures of, of many people that they have uh, they are living here uh, on the walls and then they are teaching them the kids of uh, what the sea is all about yeah, a beautiful beautiful village Uh, this is the fortress of San Clement in uh, Paris and uh, there are a couple of things uh, that I have to notice that they have a fortress and they have a church just like this one and uh, of, of course every every city in, uh, in Italy they have a, a harbor, a church and a, a fortress to the same, defend themselves, lots of wars and battles between them all the time but those three things are always there a church uh, a fortress and a harbor beautiful beautiful place but uh, full of history of battles and, and and wars that's the way humanity is Uh, this is the port of uh, the harbor of Bindisi, very similar to the previous one. And uh, this is my crew now. Uh, Finn, the son of uh, Patrick, left us. He needed to go back to Netherlands. And uh, this is the stairs of uh, Mussolini, where he actually got his last stand before he was captured. And um, this is uh, one of the churches here. The I think it's the San Clement. Uh, basilica and uh, is in the center of the city as i said they, they have uh, churches uh, in every corner here in um, in italy and you're going to see in a few moments the inside of the church of the church which also uh, kind of look alike Well, continuing with the trip, this is the harbor of Le Castella, and as usual, they have the, the castle over there. It was built, built by the Arabs, and then uh, before that by the Romans, very famous port. And uh, we are heading along uh, uh, in calm seas, a very beautiful day. Uh, the ocean, the sea looks very, very nice and blue. And uh, we are using our uh, to uh, 
to, to control the boat and to direct the boat, we are using a wind vane, uh, which is a hydro vane, wind vane. Um, and it's a mechanical device that actually uses the wind in order to uh, steer the boat. Uh, it's a very useful instrument. We have also two solar panels over there, uh, 100 watt each of these panels. And uh, we have the um, uh, a radar uh, and a wind generator on top of it. And on the far corner, uh, you can see there the um, uh, I think that the, the antenna for the iridium go in that corner right there. And uh, then uh, we we most of the time we use the the instruments in the cockpit instead of the cabin. So we have a, a wind speed and direction right there in the center. Then we have a depth sounder with a boat speed. And of course we have the electronic um, a autopilot and then the electronic heading for the boats in degrees. So we know where are we heading. And um, we use sometimes the autopilot, the Raymarine autopilot. Um, also, uh, just in case uh, we have uh, set up, um, uh, we do manual steering, just in case if uh, we want to uh, really maneuver the boat. So we use our Uh, this is the last stop on my journey in the south of Italy, harbor of Otranto and Santa Maria de Leuca. Uh, this is the promenade from the uh, from the city of uh, Otranto, and um, you can see, of course, the castle and the usual harbor over there, and then you will see it, the um, uh, the entrance to the city in a minute. If you have enjoyed the, uh, the, this video, please subscribe to my channel. Uh, your humble Captain Nafurman will uh, thank you from the deep of his uh, sailing heart. Thank you very much and have a wonderful day.